Whoever finds the interpretation of these sayings will not taste death. What does it mean? It means these words in this book are life and not death. As for the one who seeks, let him continue to seek until he finds. When he finds, he will become agitated. When he becomes agitated, he will be astounded, and he will reign over the all. For the one that chooses truth, those are the seekers. Let them continue to seek. Um, it's also to find the secret. Um, these secret words, as they would say, it means true words. It's hidden in God or the head, Christ. Our head. When he finds, he'll be agitated. Uh, he'll come to find the world a corpse, everybody lying, uh, not doing their oath, playing games. Um, when he becomes agitated, when he gets angry for it and he keeps his composure, uh, that is, he keeps the command of God, waits on God, he'll be astounded um, because he'll see how much God rules over it and then he will reign over the all. He will be with God at his right hand, obeying the command and the covenant. If the ones who lead you should say to you, see, the kingdom is in heaven, then the birds of heaven will precede you. If they say to you, it is in the sea, then the fish will precede you. But the kingdom is inside of you, and it is outside of you. When you know yourselves, then you will become known, and you will understand that you are the sons of the living Father. But if you will not know yourselves, you dwell in poverty, and it is you who are that poverty. The poverty is the lie, the idolatry. It's where you don't do the hand, the covenant, the vow. It's where the mark of the beast is on the right hand. Um, if you don't have your father's words, you don't have your father's God. Therefore, you have a make-believe God. You made it up yourself outside of the covenant. God is a covenantal God. We know who we serve. This has to do with the man's identity very much. The daughters are the daughters of the king. They won't be diminished. So on. The man old in days will not hesitate to ask a small child seven days old about the place of life, and he will live. It's the mother, of course. The baby will be sucking on the tit and crying for the mother. Um, as he says, when he's beaten, carrying his cross, don't cry for me, but cry for you mothers. It's because they they go to baby wards, um, facing the war, bring in the baby, and then the men go to work to pay men to take their baby from them. After they went to war, they're serving the idols. This is pretty simple. It's the abomination of desolation. And... Of course, that's what takes place in Pharaoh's Egypt when Moses comes. That's what takes place in Herod's day when Jesus was born. So forth and so on. For many who are first will become last, and they will become one and the same. Uh, when you stick up to cover the daughters, it's not very popular. Uh, men would rather do their idolatry in Gentile courts playing God. You become the woman, you cover her. That's how you become one. Recognize what is before your face, and that which is hidden from you will be revealed. For there is nothing hidden that will not become revealed. Be true, choose truth. Um, that's how you stay to the head. The only way to go. Do you to fast? And how shall we pray? Shall we give alms? What kind of diet shall we observe? Do not tell lies, and do not do what you hate. For all things are revealed before heaven. For there is nothing hidden which will not become manifest, 
and nothing covered will remain without being uncovered. Again, what is the truth? Blessed is the lion which the man will eat. Um, what is your court system, your legality, your universities? So that the lion becomes man, and cursed is the man whom the lion will eat, so that the lion becomes a man. It means you shouldn't be serving your idols and servants, they should be serving you. The man is like a wise fisherman who threw his net into the sea and drew it up from the sea. It was full of small fish. Among them, the wise fisherman found a good, large fish. He threw all the small fish back into the sea and without much trouble chose the large fish. Whoever has ears to hear, let him hear. What is the mother's? Um, he made them all one, every daughter a mother by the blood, chastised in Eden, and therefore it makes all the fish into one. And so this is the heavy matter. She's the chief of all matters. See, the sower went out, took a handful of seeds and scattered them. Some fell on the road and the birds came and gathered them up. Others fell on the rock and they did not take root in the soil, and did not yield ear. What is they did not do the roots of the fathers? Um, the birds picked it up. Uh, that's gossip, where the men don't become men, and they gossip like women, and they'll, so they're like birds. They'll peck at you, and then when you get up, they'll fly away. Um, usually the birds are a good... Thing of the women, but there it's in the sense that you and your own opinions have chewed it up. Um, and then it landed on the rock means it, it had no roots. That's also the mustard tree, the small seed. You're the seed. You're the small seed. The roots are your father's, your mother's blood. And then the branches are your sons and your brothers, your neighbors that branch out. And the stalk that stands up is the oath, the covenant, the vow. And so when you land on the soil or on the rock and you have no um, roots, that's exactly what it means. And thus they're rude. And no ears to hear means that you didn't hear the fathers. You didn't hear Moses. You didn't hear your founders because all of it's the same God. The Lord God, I'm on Isaiah 65, 16. Um, Wisdom of Solomon chapter 1 through 2, 1 and 2. And did you not and did not yield ears and others fell on thorns and they choked them. Uh, the thorns are your prisons, your universities, your license, your paid prescriptions, um, anything that would hinder you and remove binding your hands. Of course, because it would choke you, bind the hands of the shepherd and the sheep get scattered and they all get killed. And others fell on the thorns. What is also that lion they eating you? the seed and worms ate them. The worms is all them that do idolatry. Still, others fell on the soil that was good, and this produced good fruit. For it bore sixty per measure, and a hundred and twenty per measure. What is one man, or two men? Because the six is the number of man. And so he's either talking with their spouse, or with community, or... One that goes it alone. And I can't tell which one's the... Most likely the 12 is the Zodiac, the reborn. Come out to be reborn Israel. I have cast fire upon the world. What is the truth? I am watching it until it blazes. What is the truth and what also was the Jew uh, scattered about? Because he said he would scatter them and they'd be like coals to back up the Holy Scripture of Jesus Christ. And so that's also the flames that have been lighting. That's why the world seems to be getting faster is because the, the monotheistic God is taking, blazing the whole world. 